our success will establish the selective therapeutic filtration industry. The hurdles are a little higher being the first guy through. My name is Jim Joyce. I'm the chairman, CEO, and founder of Athlon Medical. Well, Athlon Medical is a company that I founded just over a decade ago. And the mission of the company is to establish the industry for selective therapeutic filtration devices, essentially devices that can remove harmful targets such as viruses or cancer-promoting targets from the entire circulatory system on a very rapid basis and do it without removing essential elements uh, from the blood. Our core focus is advancing a platform technology that we call the Athlon ADAPT system. And ADAPT is an acronym for Adaptive Dialysis-like Affinity Platform Technology. Basically, it's the intersection of advanced plasma filtration technology and affinity drug agents. We marry those two together to create an extracorporeal therapy that provides rapid real-time clearance of targets from circulatory system and to create therapies that can be adjuncts to other standard of care therapies without adding additional drug toxicity or interaction risk. In the hemopurifier, uh, we're marrying up advanced plasma filtration technology with affinity agents that really go way beyond the capability of affinity drugs that exist in the marketplace today. So in this cartridge, we have about 2,800 hollow fibers. When blood flows through the fibers, uh, it flows through the fibers. The walls of all the fibers are porous in nature. The median size of the pores of the fiber walls are about 250 nanometers. So as blood flows through, particles are separated away from blood cells particles that are below 250 nanometers in size, and they move to an outer chamber. And these particles then run across what we call an affinity matrix. But the key component in that affinity matrix is a agent that can bind our target. So in around 2004, we started advancing the hemopurifier in a, with a mechanism where we were mobilizing affinity lectin uh, agents. Uh, and these are agents that there was great hope that they could evolve as drug agents in the marketplace and be the first agents that provided broad spectrum antiviral activity against different strains, species, and families of viruses. They're able to bind to unique high nanosignatures that reside on glycoproteins that coat viruses in general. Uh, they, never, they never made it into the marketplace as drugs. However, when we use them in a subtractive strategy where we're bringing the target into the cartridge, uh, they work beautifully and what we've been able to demonstrate in human studies is a very substantial uh, impact in reducing viral load in HIV and hepatitis C patients in the absence of any drug therapy but our lead indication is directed towards hepatitis C and it's in that area where we're seeing the ability to eliminate viral load at a rate that you would normally never see in drug therapy alone. We're preparing first commercialization overseas. Uh, it's our expectation that later this fall we'll be initiating our first uh, clinical programs through an IDE submission to FDA uh, and that'll be occurring uh, at Beth Israel Medical Center in Manhattan. Our primary focus is directed towards exosomes and we have played an instrumental role in the discovery of exosomes and their implications in cancer. Uh, when we first started looking at exosomes, I think the uh, first response I had from colleagues at the National Cancer Institute when I was researching uh, the potential implications of uh, exosomes in cancer was exo what? And this was a little over five years ago. And since that period of time, uh, the medical community consensus has gone from these particles don't have any meaningful biological function to now understanding that these particles are extremely immunosuppressive. These are particles that kill off the immune cells you need to combat cancer. That research has stimulated more researchers uh, to look at tumor-secreted exosomes, whether it's breast cancer, lung cancer, ovarian cancer, 
regardless of the form of cancer. Uh, and research has now demonstrated that these exosomes play an instrumental role in allowing or promoting angiogenesis. And in the last issue of Nature, it's now been discovered, researchers now publish, that these same exosomes are the seed that spreads metastases. Uh, so they're very important targets. We started research in this a number of years ago, so we're very well positioned uh, to move the technology into the marketplace. And it's the same hemopurifier technology uh, that's removing infectious viruses that is able to target exosomes uh, in cancer. And so this is a very exciting area for us. They can call us directly. Phone number is area code 858-459-7800, or they can go to our website, which is www.athlonmedical.com.